Hello, and welcome to Medical Terminology. My name is Cindy Garner, and I'll be one of your instructors on the Medical Terminology team. The other instructor will be Sarah Parker. In this course, some of our objectives are to learn the commonly used medical terms and abbreviations. We'll also learn the meanings of different pieces of the terms, such as the prefixes, the suffixes, and the root word, and then combine them all using them in medical settings. We'll also learn the correct spelling and pronunciation of the medical terms. Many of the terms in medical terminology sound very similar and are also spelled very similarly. So it's important to be able to spell them and pronounce them correctly. We'll also relate the terms that we're using to the structure and function of every body system. We'll also examine the body system so you have a comprehension of how each body system works. For the class materials, you will need to purchase two items. The first is the textbook. It's The Language of Medicine by Dabby Ellen Chabner. It's the 11th edition, and it is very important to use the required 11th edition for this course. The second thing you'll need is the online access code. This will allow you access to the homework assignments, the quizzes, and the midterm and the final exam. So you will need to purchase this as well. Both items are available at both bookstores at Clackamas Community College. You can also get them on the Elsevier website that I'm going to show you momentarily. A couple of words about the class syllabus. The class syllabus will be your guide for the course. It describes the assignments, what is due when, we will um, change new assignments weekly, so it's important to pay close attention to that syllabus. Please print it out, read it, and keep it with you. We'll also be sending you emails quite frequently using your student.clackamas.edu email address. So please make sure, if that's not normally the email address you use, uh, please be sure to check it frequently. So now we're going to go through the registration process. You've registered for the course for at CCC. You have gotten your book and your access code. Now it's time to redeem your access code. So the first step is you want to get to this website here. It's www.evolve.elsevier.com. Once you're here, you're going to need to create an account. The key to this is to create an account using your student.clackamas.edu email address. When you do that, it will sync with Moodle and you'll be able to access all the homework assignments. On the Evolve website, at the top right corner, click Sign In and Create an Account. Here, you'll create a student account and complete the required information that they request. Again, important to use your student.clackmas.edu email address. Otherwise, you won't be able to see the assignments. Once you've completed this page, hit Submit. And then that will take you back to the main page again. Here's where we'll redeem your access code. Open this package, and inside there will be a silver strip that you'll rub off, and there will be an access code underneath. Type the access code in this area here where it says to redeem an access code. Click Submit, then it'll ask you to fill in your student name, the date of your graduation, the name of your school, etc. Some of those fields are, requ are required. You'll need to complete those fields as appropriate and then click redeem. Once you've redeemed it, you are all set with uh, registration 
into the course. And you'll be done with the Elsevier website. At that point, you will be able to go into Moodle and access all of the homework assignments and quizzes on our course page for MA 110. All of the homework will be done on the Moodle website. It will not be done on Elsevier. Okay. If you come down here to week one, you'll see all the homework assignments listed here. I'll be going over the homework assignments in the very next video. If you have any further questions about registrations after watching this video, please send um, your teacher an email and she'll be happy to help. Thank you for the time and enjoy learning this new language.